Today is the start of a new era in Ottawa. I will challenge you guys to rise to new levels. Coach will lead the way. He will give you the blueprint, but you guys will ultimately take us where we need to go. Finally, to the man beside me. Um, thank you uh, for letting me see through the, the process. I know it probably couldn't have been easy. Um, I treated Bob like any other candidate through this, and uh, I thought that was important. I thought the four weeks, four games, five weeks of us working together in a different landscape set the tone for what this is. And what I've said from day one is the head coach general manager relationship is a partnership. It's not about hierarchy, it's about a partnership. And for a guy that I probably never had a conversation with until a little less than a year ago, uh, for the growth we've had in our relationship, and most of all, the trust and faith I can put in him leading this organization, because ultimately the head coach is the leader of the organization. I have a strength as a coach it's that I'm able to build relationships, trusting, honest ones. And uh, going through this process, um, even learn more about Sean. I know they were doing a lot to learn more about me, but I learned more about Sean and uh, just really looking forward. I'm excited that that whole group has given me the opportunity to lead this team in 20, 20, sorry, 2023 and, uh, and beyond. I'm extremely excited. Obviously, I've been here in Ottawa for seven years. And... Uh, you know, one thing that I've been able to experience is learn and uh, get an understanding of this city. And what I realize is how passionate the fans are in this city, how passionate the players are on this team, and how passionate Osage is about this uh, whole Lansdowne area. And one thing when, you, when you're coaching the CFL, you want to be in a city that cares about football, and Ottawa is exactly that. <laughs>